Jessica Vanessa is the number one twerker in the world with two million social media followers. I give her a 10 out of 10. And the 22-year-old makes a six-figure salary from her online appearances. What I make in six seconds would take me like four months to make as a pre-K teacher at work. It's just because boys are perverted. I don't necessarily want to say my income, but I can tell you this, I bought a new car, paid it off in full, and I was able to get out of debt from my school that I graduated from. Uh, she come out to this part of the beach more often. Sit down to the side. Jessica used to work as a kindergarten teacher, but took a huge risk by quitting her job to focus on making her videos. Either I make money on the internet, I make money doing these videos, or I'm gonna be broke and jobless. And once I quit, thank God, all these opportunities out of nowhere for some reason just rams into my face like, hey, we want you here, we want you there, come travel here, come travel there. We're gonna offer you this much money and this much money. And I was like, whoa, 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 you know, it was like so much to take in. However, social media sensation Jessica wasn't always this outgoing. When I was younger, I was very shy. I didn't like dancing in front of anybody. I didn't talk unless I was spoken to. I started to hang out with a different crowd. That crowd was more outgoing, and I guess that's what brought out a different side of me. Bow, 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 bow. And I've always had it in me, the, the energetic side, the, the real outgoing, the, the dancing, the twerking. I guess I didn't really break out of it until my middle school years. And then once I hit high school, it was a wrap from there. Everybody in high school knew me as like the party girl. Oh my God. And despite her online popularity, she's faced criticism so harsh that she's thought about giving up. People like to define twerking as you're a whore if you do it. No, it's just a type of dance, that's it. If you were open-minded, you would understand that. I do get plenty of comments, rude comments, mean comments. I've had two breakdowns where I just wanted to delete all my social networks. At one point, I was just getting hate after hate after hate. And it really, really got to me. And I remember I cried in my room and I just kind of like closed the door. And, you know, like I didn't have anybody to go to. So I was just real like to myself. I felt alone, like how can I have one point, you know, nine million followers and feel this alone? However, she can rely on the support of her family. When it comes to my twerking, they're very open-minded people. They don't look at it as degrading. They don't look at it in disgust. Uh, they're very supportive. Whatever I like doing, whatever I feel like doing, yeah, go ahead and do it is what they would say. Her brother Joshua is her cameraman, and Jessica says even her grandmother would approve. She's wild and crazy like me, so if I were to show her, she would probably get excited and try to do it with me. So I could twerk in front of my grandma, and she'd be like, oh, go ahead, girl. Like, she'd be excited for it. Jessica's dad, Rafael, does have some reservations, though. I do worry. Uh, I think the, the twerking videos, you know, they, pe my, most people might consider it sexual. Not something I really want my daughter, you know, name with but I know it goes with the territory. I look at it from a different light. I look at it as she's, she's just having fun. And if that's you know what she likes to do and that's what she wants to do, then I'm gonna support her 100%. I even joked around with her telling her one time I wanted to do one with her. You know, I don't think I will. So with her lucrative online career based on twerking videos and comedy skits firmly established, does she ever think about returning to work as a teacher? I don't necessarily miss being a, a pre-K teacher. I do miss the people that I used to work with as well as uh, my old kids, but I never enjoyed working nine to five, 12 to seven, two to seven, however many hours it took, just because I always liked entertaining people. As a little girl, I always wanted to be somebody big. I always wanted to entertain people.